Alright, hey guys, welcome to another tutorial. This time we're going to be looking at a login reward system. Um, yeah, let's take a look. So, what you're going to do first is head to my Dropbox and download this folder right here. The login, um, the, the, the login um, reward script. Uh, in that fo folder, you're going to have these two items on the right hand side. Uh, once you've done that, we are going to head over to wherever you, is it you've... Um, installed your server app, be it a paid one or a um, one on your computer, home one. Um, yeah, next thing you're going to do, excuse me, next thing we're going to do is we're going to head down to MP Missions, we're going to go in there and unpack your trusted PBO, you're going to right click on your PBO and um, open with PBO Manager, go down to the bottom link and open. Uh, just go ahead and save an original just in case, just make yourself a box, uh, press new and a uh, new folder and call it original or call it backup or whatever it is that you want to call it. Um, once you've done that just go ahead and save your um, last working PBO that you know definitely worked and that way then you've got something to revert back to just in case. Um, right, so once you've done that and you've unpacked your PBO, I'm going to be using Chinaris Redux today, I'm going to go in there and here we are, voila, yours is going to look something kind of similar to this if not the same, uh, maybe a little bit different. Um, right, so the next thing you're going to do is you are going to come back over here to the right and you are going to copy this top one, this ETG. We're going to copy that and we're going to paste that into our customs folder. If you don't have a customs folder, just go ahead and make one. Just right click, new folder, call it customs. And if we go in here, there it is right there. You can see it right there. Um, so just go ahead and paste it in your customs folder. And the next thing you're going to do is we are going to head to the init, um, init player local. And um, we're going to click on this and we're going to grab this line right here. Uh, we're going to copy and we're going to head to the init player local, which is right here. And we're going to head down near the bottom where you would normally put all the rest of your stuff underneath there for each NPCs. Um, this is where I normally put um, lines of whatever it is that I need to put on here. So as you can see, mine is right here. Just go ahead and go down to the bottom of the, um, the one that you've already got in here. Or if you haven't got any in here, just do it straight underneath the um, for each uh, NPCs, um, which is part of this top part where your um, traders are um, but yeah go ahead and paste that in don't forget to press save uh, and that's it that's done um, this all uh, it's it's like a little um, a little login um, rewards thing uh, after so many logins um, you do have to be on the server for an hour um, in order to get the um, rewards the rewards are um, customizable as well um, it is kind of, um, if I go into the script and show you, I haven't got any in-game footage unfortunately because I'd be sat there all day waiting and yeah, that'd be, just be a pain in the ass. But I have, it, it does work, I have seen it. Um, it, it tells, after, I mean if we look at it here, um, this, this is the actual script itself. Um, as you can see there's uh, 10 tiers and after 5 logins um, you get a reward, a food and a drink. Um, you can change all this as well if you want to, after 10 logins um yeah and so on you have to 50 logins uh yada yada um but yeah it, cha it changes you know every, every time you log out and log back in you know, it is kind of capped as well the fact that um if you you know you, some somebody's you know if some if you get a random joe you know that um just wants to fucking try and get a load of free stuff and you know just kind of keep it at this if you want guys i mean it's you know it's just random food and a piece of duct tape you know um <clears throat> but you know it's it's just them that's going to be having a boring time on your server because all they're going to be doing is re-logging and they've got to wait an hour for the reward so you know it's just a little reward thing you know just 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 a little little gimmick for in game but um <coughs> excuse me um but yeah as you can see here it tells you what you get um if you scroll right down here um this is where you would change all the um tiers so tier 10 um you get a bottle of beer duct tape and a instock um but yeah you know there's uh, tapes just just go ahead and ed edit these lines um for for the number on the end, that would be how how many of the item you actually get. So you get one duct tape sent to you and one insta dock um, for a tier eight. Um, you could add more stuff on here. 
I'm presuming. Yep. So you would um so on on this you would just create a, a new line if it was me I'd copy this line and I would um drop it down I'd paste it in here and then I would just change whatever is in here for something out of my exile stuff so um if we go back to the folder go to our traders uh, go to exile you don't have to necessarily use exile if you've got RHS or if you've got cup installed or whatever else if you want a piece of clothing that somebody might get um you know and you want to send that to them just go ahead and jot that line in there if we get I mean if just for example um if we was to go in exile and uh, if we go in here and if we go all the way down to what we've got here headsets uh, glasses um, yeah let's do a, t a, t a, tin, a tin of noodles alright so all you're gonna do is grab this whole part here we're gonna copy gonna go back to the f um, file and you're gonna paste it in here obviously I know I've just picked up the um, the hyphens or whatever you want to call them as well, the commas or whatever. Um, but yeah, you just replace that whole whole part there. Don't knock off anything else, the little dash or anything. Um, but yeah, uh, that would obviously be in this new line that was just talking about. If you was to add something else in there. Um, but yeah, nice little mod. Well, nice little nice little gimmick really for your server. Um, you know, it's just something really easy and. Uh, just reward your players, really. You know, so something you know, something little, and um, yeah, but it's quite good. But right, anyway, hope you did like, guys. Um, if you do get any problems, head over to my Discord channel. The link for that is up top of my YouTube page on the right hand side, right next to the big fat donations button. If you're feeling generous. All right, guys, I will see you in the next video. See you later.